So, micros, we all love them, don't we? The one problem that I've had with these is always finding a viable way to record our video. Now, as you see in my past videos, I have, uh, I've experimented with the Cyclops DVR. I've experimented with the SQ-12, which is okay, but still you have to tie that on. And, you know, the, I think the, the frame rate of that camera, the dropping frames, I didn't like it. So I've kind of stuck to using the onboard DVR, which is great. I think onboard DVR is quite, you know, okay. But here I have something else right here. Some of you might recognize this camera. That's right, that's the camera from the Sheen Lizard 105S, I think. That's what they call it. Now that frame is really ugly, so what I've done, I've built this. This is not the components, it's just the camera. Now when I saw the Ishin Lizard, the first thing that caught my attention was the 720p onboard recorder. I thought that was a massive thing, if that would work really well, but I thought there must be latency. There's got to be latency, because every camera I've ever tried that's an FPV feed and an HD recorder, always introduces a bunch of latency that makes it almost unflyable. Even the Runcam split has some latency. I have not tried it, but I've heard it from people, so I will trust that that's what it is. However, when I heard the reviews, I think it was Albert Kim who was one of the first that I saw, he mentioned that there was no latency, and I thought that's impossible. So I thought I couldn't wait to get my hands on one. And then all of a sudden I noticed that they have this as a spare part. So you can buy the board, you can buy the camera and you can buy the case that it goes into. To mount it was a bit difficult because it's really small. It doesn't fit in the regular um, size case. So yeah, that's what I had to do. So be where you can maybe get a 3D printed mount thingy and mount that in there. So yeah, that's what I did. And I'm just going to show you what it looks like. This is not run cam split quality. It's just okay. And it's a nice way to view your footage that is not SD. It's 720, but it's 60 frames per second, bros. Like, seriously, that's crazy for a small micro drone. You know, and you could say, oh, I just get a run cam split. This is like, what, less than half the weight? I just find this a lot nicer. I mean, I haven't flown it that much. I just think that the results I got right now is pretty neat. So, you know, you can put this in any frame if you want. Don't have to get this one. But anyway, here's my footage. Enjoy.